hey guys what is up welcome back to the channel welcome back to the another video and it's been 24 hours that i am using ios 18.3 beta 1 as you know ios 18.3 beta 1 is not a big update i talk about what is new i mentioned all the changes regarding ios 18.3 beta 1 in today's morning video go to my channel check out that video in this video i'm going to talk about the battery life and the performance i will also share geekbench score so you can have the idea about the battery life and the performance important thing i know it's been just out it's just 24 hours i was always take couple of days to get better to get stable it is just my first impression regarding ios 18.3 beta 1 so without any further delay let's get jump into this video and let's begin with the battery life so i'm here in the settings and let the battery stats load as you can see this is the day i used ios 18.3 beta 1 it's been one day so this is only one day stat as you can see this graph it is slightly higher than the 75 percent so i can consider this 75 to 80 percent as you can see and against this i got screen on time of 6 hours and 37 minutes in which i use instagram tiktok tap bad geek badge whatsapp youtube threads and some other applications as you can see now this is not the best screen on time i was having a better screen on time on ios 18.2 it is slightly lower than the ios 18.2 but obviously it's the first beta of ios 18.3 when more betas will come it will get better hopefully but yes again this is a decent score not the best one not the better than the 18.2 but still it's a really good and a decent screen on time now let's move to the geek patch over here so i ran two different geek patch tests when i installed the ios 18.3 beta 1 i ran a geek patch test let me show you that result so over here in the geek page cpu benchmark cpu history this is the first result that i ran as you can see the operating system i'm running ios 18.3 this is ios 18.3 beta 1 2336 or a single core while 5770 or a multi-core this is not a good score but it's a decent score single score score is decent it's a good score or a multi-core score is a decent score this is the score i ran this test when i just updated my device and after a few hours i ran a test again and after that i got a score again operating system is 18.3 as you can see i got 2366 on a multi-core this is a really good score and 5847 on a, a multi-core this is a single core this is a multi-core so over here after a few hours the tests are really good results are really good and all paper it saves a good performance again these scores are lower than 18.2 and that is obvious because it's the first beta and while the more betas will come it will eventually get higher hopefully but still it's a decent good score so yeah this is all about the performance and the battery life so far everything is working really fine i am really enjoying the performance i have no issue at all one question that i'm getting a lot from you guys is that is there a gray light in photos application that was there in every other uh update but i haven't noticed that in 18.3 yet if i notice that i will definitely let you know guys but hopefully for now it is not there well this is all from this video it's a, just a small and simple video i want to talk about ios 18.3 beta 1 after using it for 24 hours one thing i also want to talk about is the release date of ios 18.3 beta 2 well it's a holiday season and whenever it comes the holiday season apple actually take a break in breaking updates so for the next week for next couple of weeks we are not expecting any sort of update because of the holidays so during the holidays it is obvious there will be no update the the final update i mean the next beta 2 update i am guessing i am expecting that is going to be in the second week of january that can be around 6th of january so there will be a lot of mondays that will get skipped as you can see there will be no update during these weeks 
I'm expecting this to get over here after the holidays. Again, this is my guess. This is my expectation. It can be different. I will definitely update you guys if there will be any sort of news or anything else. But so far, again, I was 18.3. Beta one is here. It's been 24 hours. Battle life is decent. Performance is also going really good so far. No issue at all. And yeah, everything is fine. And also, it's not a big update. Whenever it comes to a big update, normally dot two and dot four updates are big. As you can see, eighteen point two was a big update. So yeah, dot two and dot four updates are usually big if we look at the history. So eighteen point four will be a big update, but that is coming very late, maybe in April for the public. But we will talk about that while it will come. But for now, 18.3 is here and there are few refinements, enhancements, bug fixes, but nothing big over here. Also, I want to talk about one thing that I missed in my uh, today's video that is regarding the release notes of iOS 18.3 beta 1. So for that, I will go to the Safari over here. Let me bring out the release notes. I think okay let me find uh, I was 18.3 beta release notes over here there is nothing lot of th lot mentioned Apple just mentioned a couple of resolved issues as you can see a personalized Genmoji might not generate without selecting a different person it is also fixed over here regarding writing tools for third-party apps adopting writing tools api on ios if the first responder is not a ui view it will not able to use complete inline experience that is also fixed so two different sort of bugs have been mentioned over here regarding genmoji and writing tools that is fixed over here other than that there is nothing fancy going on well this is all from this video also the last thing i have seen that many people are coming to my channel thank you so much for your support guys but there are very few people that are subscribing to the channel i mean the rate of subscribers is very very low so guys come on please make sure to subscribe because i'm always here breaking latest news regarding ios not only news i also bring real world tests in which i go through a day using different applications and share how the experience is going on with the latest updates of ios i comes up with the three day reviews five day reviews so you can have an idea about the performance of the ios 18 point whatever ios it is so yeah make sure to subscribe well finally this is all from this video and hopefully we will catch you i will catch you guys in some other video uh, hopefully tomorrow and i will see you take care peace out